Hi guys, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how you can reset the local administrator password if you've forgotten it. Uh, I'm going to show you two methods. Both of these methods not only reset the administrator account, but you can reset any password on the system at all. So I'm going to show you two methods. The first method is if you've got a user account that's an administrator on the machine that you can log on with, so you know the password. So I know my password to my JSON account, so I'm just logging on to that. The second method I'm going to show you is if you don't know any passwords to any any accounts on the system at all, I'm going to show you a sneaky way that you can uh, recover the password. So I've logged on with my JSON account now, so if you click on the start menu, type in NET PLWIZ and click on this program. I'm going to put all the commands below in the description just in case you miss any. So you can see here we've got two accounts on the system and both are administrators. So we want to recover the administrator password. So click reset password, enter the password twice, press OK, and then you'll be able to log out and log back in as the administrator. Now, if you don't have uh, any passwords, as I said, there's another method where you can recover the password. So what you need to do is you need to put the Windows 10 install CD into your system and restart. Uh, if you don't have your Windows 10 install CD, um, I could post a link to another video in the uh, comment in the description here that shows you exactly how to uh, create an install CD. Uh, but basically what you do is you download the Windows 10 media creation tool from Microsoft, double click on it and it will load this application, click accept. We want to create, it will create a USB flash drive that you can boot to or a DVD. So if we click next, and use recommendations. So if you want to create a bootable USB drive, uh, select that one. If you want to create a Windows DVD, select that. It will then download the ISO. Once the ISO is downloaded, just right click on it and burn to disk. And then put that disk in your system and then restart. So press any key here. So what this is going to do, it's going to boot to the uh, Windows 10 Media, the DVD or the USB drive that we've created. And it enables you to run some recovery tools. Uh, so select your options there and click Next. Don't click on Install now, click on Repair Your Computer. Now click on Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, Command Prompt. You could do a system restore. If you've changed the password recently, and you've forgotten it, it's possible you could do a restore to restore the system to before you change the password. Uh, be aware if you've installed any software or made any changes to your system you might lose those as well. So I'd recommend to try this method first. So you need to type in this command. Okay, you shouldn't get this prompt because I've done this before. It's asking if I want to overwrite again, so you shouldn't get that prompt up. So, okay, we can see that one file was moved successfully. You then need to run a second command. Okay, both files have successfully copied. I'm going to paste um, these commands in the description below, just in case you've missed it. They're quite long commands. So now we need to exit this command prompt window. And if we click on continue, if we 
don't press any key because we don't want to boot into the uh, Windows 10 media again. We want to boot to the Windows 10 desktop. Okay, so press any key to get this up. Press on the middle icon here. And then you get the command prompt up here. Okay, so I've just typed in net user administrator. We can see that the account is active there. Um, if it's not active, you need to make it active by typing in that command, active yes. Then There we go. That has reset the password. So if we come back to the administrator, I think that looks good. It says welcome, so that should be logging us on now. Okay, and we're in. Thanks for watching the video. If you have any comments, please post them below. Let me know how you get on with resetting your password as well. Um, but thanks for watching.